You are now watching a Lucky Penny Shop product feature. Hey, it's Lucky Penny Shop, and it's time for another toy gun in our toy gun series. Now, we've done stuffed animal shooters, bow and arrows, other types of toy guns, not just uh, Nerf guns, so we kind of mix it up. This is a rubber band shooter from Hotheads Products. It's from Five Below, and it was a dollar. It includes 100 rubber bands and a removable storage box. Do not aim directly at another person. Now, this would probably be good if you're fly hunting. I've done fly hunting in the past, and rubber bands seem to work pretty good. So you can clip it onto your belt loop, I guess, and have it handy. I don't think most schools will let you take this in there and clip it onto your backpack, so don't do that. Uh, let's see. Start rubber band here. Stretch rubber band back and pinch in grippers. Squeeze easy grip spring loaded handle. It says also place rubber bands around storage box. That gives you quick rubber band access. Hmm. What do we do now? We test it. Now I have done other rubber band gums, gums, gums a while ago, and one of them actually would put welts on you. So not that I enjoy, you know, putting welts on skin. Let's see, this looks like it slides forward, but it's a little tight. There you go. I'm going to load up my rubber band gun. Rubber band man man, rubber band, rubber band man. Let's see the rubber band man. Yeah, I don't know. I'm not too keen on this storage. You almost need like a rubber band stopper to push them in. But let's just run with it here. Okay, let's run with it. Let's let's do this. Okay. Then let's get some of these on here. Kind of make it like the picture. Is there really a hundred rubber bands here? That's a good question. Would you take the time to count all one hundred just to see you weren't getting Rubber band gypped. Rubber band man man. Rubber band rubber band man. Okay. There, I like that. Now slide this back on. Okay, so let's see. Oh, there's the spring loaded clip. So it's just like a round loop that's doing it. Okay, so up here. And then here, Ooh, that's that's pretty pretty loose mechanism there. I will shoot it at my hand. Well, yeah, from a distance, just to see if I feel it. Okay, it's a t light light mini ting. It's not really anything that would cause any kind of skin thing. You hit right here on my hand, and you don't see anything there. Let's do it on the top of my hand this way. Yeah, it hit right about here. So it's really not going to hurt if it hits you. Let's see if distance-wise it hits to the back. Here we go. Yeah, I might be able to set up a few little targets for this that are light and easy to hit. I won't bring out my big targeting system, but let me go grab some things now that I know what this thing does. And I will be right back. All right, I am back. I found some smaller targets. Hopefully things I can knock over with my rubber band gun. Let's start from left to right. That hand. That hand was in a growing hand video, which still gets a lot of comments and a lot of views. And I kept it after it grew to full size and I took it out of the water and it shrunk down. And it's pretty creepy. Every time I see it, it creeps me out, really. But it was there and it looks like I can knock it over. And then the squeaky green character. I don't know, kind of looks like Mario, but I'm not sure what set that's from. And then a little green man, and then another squinky. It's like a little squinky baby bottle. Squinky, squinky, squinky. Should be easy to knock over, but it's small. Let's shoot the hand. I'm about six inches away. Let's see. And I missed it. I actually bounced from the back and hit it on the back. Here we go. Ooh, just to the edge. I gotta see something knock over. Ooh, there. Okay. Now the little squinky. He's gonna be hard. Because I'm not sure exactly how to aim this thing just yet. Here's the squinky. 
just to the left of him, I think. Let's try Squinky Boy again. No. All right, Squinky's going to be hard. Let me try, try this, I don't know, Luigi Mario character. I don't know who he is. Just to the left of him. I want to get some more ammunition out. Ooh, rubber bands everywhere. Here we go. Okay, looks like aiming is really hard to do, so I'm going to get a little bit closer. Okay, knocked him off. Little green man, let's go over there. Here he is. There, you're with me now. Looks like I'm right on him, doesn't it? Ooh, I hit him. Now, he's the heaviest out of everything there, believe it or not. He's got some girth around him. Oops. How about I just hit the cup? All right, let me try one more time on him. Missed him again. It's really hard to aim. Here's the cup. So you saw it move, right? And it made a sound. I guess it works. I mean, we could say it works. Here's a little bottle. This one's going to be really tough. If I could hit this from here, it would be amazing. Nope, it's not amazing. I'm unamazing. But that's okay. Let's try the next one. Got it. Wow. All right. I've almost hit everything. Except for my little boy Squinky there. It looks like he's got one arm. Yep, someone chewed off his arm. We've got these bins of stuff that we just collect and, you know, one day we'll use. So we have a squinky with one arm. Okay, I won't be satisfied till I take him out. Poor little guy. All right, so I'll do it 25 times if it takes it. Okay, I'm going to keep going. He keeps going to the left, so I'm going to aim it to the right of him just a little. Got him. Well, there you go. I've hit everything. Let me just set this up. Let's see if I can knock this bowl off. Here we go. A little further back. Hitting the bowl. All right. You know, I guess you can find fun with it. It's okay. Maybe if you're in an office and someone's a few cubicles around and you want to just, you know, hit the ceiling and let it land on them. Because you're not supposed to shoot it at people. Remember that. All right. Here we go, last shot. Well, what do you think? Made a nice little mess, rubber bands everywhere. It is the rubber band shooter from, what was it? Hotheads Products, we got it at five below. And thanks for watching. And again, you know, I need to hear from you in the comments because we're not getting a lot of action on our toy gun videos. And uh, we need to hear from you. And if you wanna see more of those videos, look in the description, we'll have a playlist, or as always, search our channel. And thank you for watching, and if you're new to the channel, let us know in the comments. We'd love to hear from you. Later! If you're looking for the item you just saw in the video, click here. Watch more videos by clicking here. Don't forget to share on social media and give a thumbs up. Hey, LPS Dave. What's up, Butch? Make sure they don't forget to subscribe. Oh yeah, please click here to subscribe to Lucky Penny Shop. And always remember when you see a lucky penny, pick it up. Thanks for watching.